Hey everybody, Wesley over at Lewis RV Center. Today we are featuring the all new Forest River No Boundaries RVS1 RV Suite. This is the latest and greatest from Forest River. This is gonna be a game changer, folks. Some of the features that you're gonna see on the outside, gel coat, fiberglass exterior. You're gonna get Asdell with an aluminum cage construction. You're gonna get a PVC membrane and much, much more. I wanna showcase off these beautiful frameless tinted windows. Makes it look super clean, super residential. Come on with me towards the front. Check out that big, beautiful front cap window there. Again, frameless tinted windows. Right below that is gonna be a massive storage uh, toolbox here. You could call it, you can put extra batteries in here, or again, you can use it for extra storage. You are also gonna get a power tongue jack right here. Very easy to function. That way you're not breaking your back when you're breaking, uh, when you're setting up or breaking down. Coming around over here to the non-door side, you're gonna notice that it's gonna have a solar on the side plug as well as black tank flush. Along with that solar on the side plug, it is going to be prepped for solar on the rooftop as well. Coming on down here, this is a 50 amp setup. So it's two air conditioners with the 50 amp setup. If you're in an RV park that has its own cable system or satellite, you've got an extra plug right there, hook in, and you can watch all your favorite sporting events and television shows. You're gonna have these very nice, durable, off-road, all-terrain tires on aluminum wheels. Plus you have a centralized water connection station right here, fresh water as well as your city water and there is a spray port right there, folks. I wanna point out that this has a 93 gallon fresh water tank. I mean, it is huge, folks. And then coming on over here, you're also going to notice the Lippert on the go ladder prep. So if you wanna add a ladder to this after the fact, you can add it because it's already prepped for one. It's just your hook in and go. And coming on around to the back, I want to showcase this Hitchfire propane grill. I mean, this thing is awesome. You've got a couple little prep tables on each side, plus you have all kinds of surface area for cooking burgers, steaks, hot dogs, all of your favorite outdoor meals. Plus, if you don't wanna have it right here in front of the sun deck, it is on this nice little swivel mechanism and you can just circle it around and position it however you like. Again, this thing is big. It's got a lot of surface area. It's gonna make you the iron chef of your campground. Come on around here. I wanna showcase more of this sun deck. It is four feet deep. It's got its own uh, stairway up into it. Plus, it's got a very, very strong magnet. That way that door doesn't fly open when you're pulling it down the road pop that open and you have all kinds of capacity up here. There's a couple bar stools inside that you can bring out here, or you can use your own bag chairs or whatever type of seating that you wanna use. So let's go on inside and check out the inside of this RV. All right, here we are on the inside of this RV S1 RV suite. First thing we're gonna showcase is the King Suite. This is a very versatile room here, folks. It is going to have two different uses. Again, it is a king suite. We'll get to that in a moment, but as you see it, it's also got this collapsible table right here. You can use that for a dinette or you can use it for a workstation if you work remotely. This is going to have its own separate air conditioner back here, which is an awesome feature, plus its own electric heat source. One thing I wanna point out, this RV, is 100% electric, okay? The only propane that you're gonna need is for that gas grill on the outside. Again, everything else runs off electricity. So if you're using this as a workstation, check out all the plugins for all of your uh, audio devices, all of your uh, laptops, cell phones, you got USBs, you've got 110s on both 
sides, plus you're going to have an abundance of storage on both sides as well. Okay, so make sure you are utilizing all this storage space. So opening up this drawer as well, or this door as well. Again, I mean, you can use that for extra storage. This side is going to have a hanging bar. So if you need to double that as a wardrobe, you certainly can. And again, if, if this is something that you're in here, you're working, you're sleeping, you want to make this a, a more private space, check out this big drape that's going to cover this big sliding glass door. You just unhook it right there. And then you've got three hooks to hang that from. Plus you have a blackout roller shade right here as well. Plus this is going to work for you when it's time to go to sleep. So again, this is a king suite, folks. Uh, the bed is just right here. You're going to start by putting these legs up and then moving this table out of the way and then using this lever to then put the bed down. Once you have that stabilizer leg up, there's a couple little levers down here. You just pop those things in and then this table folds out of the way. And then all you're going to make sure to do is just pull this out and lock it into place from there. You're going to pull this black lever all the way up, and that's going to release the bed to come on down. Again, this is a king size mattress, and for an RV mattress, it is super plush, super comfortable, and is going to make a nice night's rest for you. And then once that is out of the way, you've got this big window right here, again, with that blackout shade to where if you want to wake up to the sun, you certainly can. And then you can pop those win that window open and get some fresh air blowing through here. Also want to highlight these little cubbies back here. You're going to see them on both sides. Both sides will feature a 110 and a USB port for your cell phones, for your books, and for all your other uh, bedside needs. All right, now we're in the living room space. I want to uh, feature this beautiful uh, chaise lounge. This is just one of two different ways that you can use it with this completely pulled out. Uh, you can use this for just watching television, or you can actually use it for an additional sleep spot. And then you can also use it this way. If you want to use it the other way, as you're closing it up, you're going to remove this piece from here. It easily slides in this already built in compartment for you. And then you just take this back lay it down and then it slides right in here for you and then you just have it as you currently see it now there is one other thing that i want to point out with this to where if you like to read or you want to have your feet elevated a little bit again while you're watching tv this center part right here can pop up as well as this back part can extend out i'm gonna move these pillows out of the way so you can see and then when you're finished using it like that, all you have to do is take this right here, pop it up, and it collapses it back down there. Right across from that, you're going to have this beautiful kitchen space. It's going to have solid surface countertops, big chef-style faucet, removable sink cover. Backside of that you can use as a cutting board. That is a stainless steel sink right there, folks. Look at that big, beautiful window. Just imagine uh, you know, a mountain back that way or a beach or your favorite lake while you're here in the kitchen. You're going to have a two-burner induction cooktop. Right below that is your convection-style microwave. You're going to have this amazing floating shelf right here with built-in hooks all the way down it for all of your kitchen essentials. Plus, you're going to have plenty of storage capacity here in these drawers and up underneath the sink as well. And then let's not forget, get a little messy while you're cooking, you have this central vacuum cleaner right here with the lift kick, and it also comes with a hose. Now, the last thing in the kitchen that I want to point out is this awesome retro style refrigerator and freezer. This is going to run off of 110, but it is huge and it's going to give you plenty of capacity here 
in your refrigerator and freezer, okay? And then the last thing we're gonna look at is right in front of that sitting spot, you're going to have a flat panel TV that is a 32 inch smart TV. It will run off of 12 volt. And then you're also going to have the electric fireplace. Again, three separate heat sources in this RV. All three are 100% electric. Now, what really makes this super special is Power Pro. So as you can see, here is your control panel where you can control everything uh, manually, or you can use the voice activated RV control system to check your tank levels, to turn the lights on, to turn the lights off, and to dim the lights. This technology is an absolute game changer. All you have to do is just say, hey, Power Pro, I'm leaving. I look forward to your return. And the lights go off. I mean, it is super, super awesome. And then when you get back home, hey, Power Pro, I'm home. Welcome back. And those lights come back on. All right, now we're headed into the bathroom. As you can see, you've got dual sinks there. So his and her sinks, big window right there. Lots of storage capacity up underneath there. Plenty of pull-out drawers, plenty of room up underneath those sinks. Uh, you've got some nice decorative wallpaper right there. Beautiful uh, residential light fixtures. Again, those LED strips running all the way across the RV. Your AC is vented and ducted into the bathroom. You've got a super spacious shower, but I do want to point out the shower head on this thing. Man, I wish I had one of these in my house. It's got multiple shower heads and shower jets to get you all nice and clean after being out and about at your campsite all day. Of course, you're going to have a foot flush stool in this and lots of storage capacity for all of your linens. And then right behind that glass door right there, or mirror door, I should say, you're going to notice that you have a combo, in-suite combo washer dryer with adjustable and or removable shelves uh, above it. Look at the capacity right there, 27 pound wash capacity, 13 pound dry capacity, already in there, already included in the sale price, folks. Again, this is the latest and greatest from Forest River. It is the No Boundaries RVS1 travel trailer. It's available right now at Lewis RV Center. We're located at 1600 East Reno Avenue. That's about five minutes east of Bass Pro Shops. Or you can give us a call, 405-232-1800. Thanks.